Mr. Bigley. Hey there, it's Gerbigly, and today I'm playing a game called Escape the Room Christmas, which sounds a lot more sinister than I hope it is. I am really worried of every time I play like an Escape the Room game because a lot of the times there are jump scares, a lot of the times you do have like a time limit. Uh, the Escape the Room series tends to be a little bit more chill, so hopefully I can reason out some of these puzzles, but I'm sure some of you are going to be screaming at the screen, not because of scares, but because of how dumb I am. So let's get started. Let's just pull off the band-aid. Let's see if I'm any good at this. Let's go. Okay, Escape the Room Christmas. I mean, I don't know, maybe we have to escape the room before Santa gets here and screams at us and beats us to death with his sack of goodies. I don't know why I went immediately there. That got dark. I'm sorry. All right, let's jump in. I got a coin right away from the bookshelf. Okay, little TV. Oh, maybe you probably have to plug in cords there. Although there's a lot of like red herring stuff in this game. Stuff you can click on, but you can't necessarily interact with. All right, we got presents under the tree. Little bobbles on the tree itself. Nothing I can click on. None of the decorations do anything. We got... Oh. Oh, die... Okay. Uh, I think that that is uh, like a clock. Was there a clock here? Oh, there is a clock here. Oh, God. Analog clock. Um, I normally just look at my phone. Uh, this is... 140? I hope I'm right. Otherwise, I look even more dumb than I normally do. Oh, boy. Okay, 140? So I think this is smaller for our time. And then 40. Oh, we did it. Oh my god, that flashed a lot. I did it, though. I do have a brain up here. It's just, it's normally pretty dormant. <laughs> That's why I gotta play more of these types of games. It helps me out a ton. Alright, we got like a minus sign. Oh god, is there gonna be math? Don't tell me because of this minus sign that there's gonna be math. That's gonna be awful if there is... All right, we got a wrench, so that's good. More of these. Okay, so these symbols are going to be important later on. Uh, probably don't have to memorize them yet. Okay, I got a piece of paper that's torn that I can't do anything with yet. Got a little decoration thing of a gingerbread guy. Very nice. Okay, we got candy canes. All right, this has got to mean something. We got a tall, short, tall, tall, short. So that's going to be a pattern later. Can't do anything with the logs yet. This panel looks like a job for our wrench. Very nice. Oh, God. We got bottom right, bottom left, bottom right, bottom left. What is this, a fighting game? Is this a Santa Claus fighting game? Is this how you make Santa Claus shoot a giant fireball? A dukin? I don't know. Okay. We have another little glass orb snow globe thing with a uh, stocking in it. Kind of cool. We have a combination. We have a safe with... Oh, wait, 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 wait. What was it? Left, right, right, left? No. Left, left, right, left. I could go just look. Why am I wasting my time? <laughs> it's literally the screen over. Okay, it's right, left, right, left. Oh, my God. All right, right, left. Oh, apparently I'd just done that before, so that's good enough. Um, oh, my God, the music. So this is the true escape room issue here is uh I, it, maybe the music will get louder the longer i take and then i'm trapped here having my ear drums blown out i don't know maybe that's the escape the room part of it <laughs> password i like that it just says password is that oh my god that actually worked <laughs> thank you password i guess i can use that wherever i want um is this for these things no not for those things Oh, I bet it's for those things. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Small, medium, large. Small, medium, large. Small, medium, large. Just like you're ordering at Burger King. Small, medium, large. Boom! Look at that. We've escaped the room, but just like the Halloween version, there's more than one room. Okay, we have logs. Oh, butane. Okay. I know I said at the beginning that this game is probably going to be less sinister than the name Escape the Room seems to imply but why is this here I, why also am i so sick that my first thought was this is gonna explode and kill me is that is it gonna be a very explosive christmas and the shrapnel's gonna destroy all of us oh god all right um what do we have here oh wait okay this was uh it was like tall short tall tall short. oh my god i can't believe i remembered that 
Scratch and win. Um, okay. Oh, I bet the coin? Four, five, two. Why can't I take that with me? Four, five, two. I can grab so much of the other stuff, but I can't grab that for some reason. Four, five, two? Oh, there's symbol. Oh, wait. I've been seeing the card symbols on the wall. Four, five. So those are going to come into play. I don't have a key for that. Four, five, two. Oh, my God. Dice. Okay. Four, five, two. Boom. Okay. Another torn piece of paper. Again, I wish I could take these. It would just be so much handier. It's got a diamond on it. What did I just pick up? Oh, I picked up another one of these globe things. I bet the globes are going to go into the... No, they can't go in the gate because this is... The, the papers. Shoot. Where do these go? Oh, do they go in here? Oh, they do go in there. Okay, wait. So I'm going to have to go back inside after I get the last globe from Snowman. Thanks so much, Frosty. Thank you very much for holding on to that for me, man. I told you years ago, keep this for safekeeping, and you did it just fine. Thank you. Nothing else on the tree. Okay, so I got to find these freaking symbols. So, oh god, I'm colorblind. I can't tell the difference between those two. So we're gonna have to swap those up. We got tree and stocking as like yellow and green? <laughs> your, your guess is as good as mine and probably better because you can probably see colors and I can't. Um, yellow and green, we got tree stocking. And we got gingerbread decoration. Gingerbread decoration is red, blue. Red, blue. Red, blue. So that, that's gonna eliminate two and then I can brute force the rest. Okay, red, blue, and then tree stocking. Oh my god, first go. Let's go. Take that, genetics. Take that, color blindness. You can't control my life. All right. I got the key that I need. I got a uh, club on torn paper. Okay, so that's going to help, I'm assuming. What's in here? The last piece I needed, I think. Is that all I needed? I gotta do a one more sweep. Okay, wait. Let's gather. So we can't take these. So the first one is gonna be spade for sure. So spade for sure. Where the heck's the other one? Wasn't there four? Wasn't there four? There has to be four. Okay. Spade for sure. Spade spade for first one. Okay, let's go back. Spade for first one. There we go. Last one is a heart for sure. Okay. Heart for sure. And then the two middle ones are... Okay, the, the fourth one was out here. I'm just dumb. I have no memory at all. I don't know why I try to play... I grew up playing point-and-click games. I love them. I have a lot of fun with them. But I don't have the memory for them. So why do I even try to play them? I don't know. I'm challenging myself, as people do. I guess back in the day, I also had like a little notepad that I would write things down manually. All right, we got diamond and club for the middle guys. So diamond... Okay, not that one. So club, and then this has to be diamond. So am I about to escape the room? I think I am. Merry freaking Christmas. There we go. We escaped the room. What? See, that's Santa's shadow menacingly over the silhouette of the moon here. Santa's on his way to get his pound of flesh. <laughs> <laughs> Again, why, why is my brain going dark and twisted and sinister? Like, I don't know. Escape the room, again, sounds just so sinister. I, I don't know. He, he looks like he's on his way to get me, but I got out of there before he could find me. But... My name's going to be on that naughty list again, and he's going to find me once more. Anyway, okay, enough of this. This game was very fun. This was pretty much a... I'm being played off by the music. Pretty much a pretty standard point-and-click adventure game. Very cool puzzles in this. I like this. You have to be crafty with some of these. There's a little bit of brute force guess and check, but mainly you can get context clues and the tools that you need to get through this pretty smoothly, I have to say. If you're struggling with any of the puzzles, just rewind the video, go back. I got your answers for you. Hopefully helping some of you out this holiday season. But hopefully you enjoyed watching me click around like a madman. If you did, please, please, please check this game out over here on lag.com. And as always, it was great seeing you. Bye-bye.